The big question is, are there new ways to advance clean energy technologies? My name is Mark Worden, Professor of Chemical Engineering at Michigan State University. The liquid fuels that we use in the cars are really important and can't be replaced in some cases by batteries and electricity. And we can produce liquid fuels without some of the disadvantages of conventional uh, biofuels by using sunlight as our power source rather than crops. We use sunlight to make electricity. The electricity splits water into hydrogen and oxygen and then we use our microbes, our bacteria, to combine the hydrogen and oxygen again into a fuel called isobutanol. It's revolutionary in the sense that it's based on hydrogen and oxygen that come from water rather than using food materials like corn to produce a fuel. That way it doesn't affect the, the food supply. 